Now we have the time showing 12 o'clock, and we're going to learn how to tell the time to the nearest 5 minutes. So let's count on in steps of 5 minutes from 12 o'clock. So now we have 12.05, or 5 minutes past 12. So when the minute hand is at 1, it's 5 past. Now we have the minute hand at 2, so it's 10 past 12, or 12.10. Now we have 12.15, or what is another way of saying 12.15? We can say it's a quarter past 12. Now with the minute hand on the 4, it's 12.20, or 20 past 12. Now with the minute hand on the 5, it's 12.25. Now the minute hand's on the 6, so it's 12.30. Or how else can we say 12.30? We can say it's half past 12. And look at the hour hand, it's moved very slowly, so it's now halfway between 12 and 1. Now the minute hand is on the 7, so it's 12.35. Now you might have noticed that with every number, the minute hand moves along we have another 5 minutes. So you can multiply the hand that the, minute ha that the minute hand is pointing to, the number that the minute hand is pointing to, you can multiply that by 5 to get the number of minutes. So here the minute hand is on the 7, and 7 times 5 is 35, so we have 35 minutes. Now the minute hand is on the 8, and 8 times 5 is 40, so we have 40 minutes. The time is 12.40. Now the time is 12.45, and how else can we say 12.45? We can say that it's a quarter to 1, because in a quarter of an hour, it will be 1 o'clock. Now the minute hand is on the 10, it's 12.50, because 10 times 5 is 50. Now with our minute hand on 11, the time is 12.55. And now, with our minute hand on 12, we don't say the time is 12.60, we say that the time is 1 o'clock. So when the minute hand's pointing to 12, it's always an o'clock time. So what time does this clock show? The hour hand is between 4 and 5, so it's 4 something. And the minute hand is on 5, and 5 times 5 is 25. So the time here is 4.25. Now what time does this clock show? The hour hand is between 10 and 11, so it's 10 something. And the minute hand is on 10, and 10 times 5 is 50, so the time is 10.50. Now what is the time here? The hour hand is between 5 and 6, so it's 5 something. And the minute hand is on 1, and 1 times 5 is 5, so it's 5 colon 0, 5. And we write 0, 5 because the number of minutes always has to be written as a two digit number. This is also why, when it's o'clock, we write zero, 00 on a digital clock. We need two zeros for o'clock, because the number of minutes must always be written with two digits. 
Now pause the video and see if you can tell the time on this clock. Well, the hour hand is between 6 and 7, so it's 6 something. And the minute hand is on 7, and 7 times 5 is 35, so the time is 6.35. And what's the time here? Well, the hour hand is between 7 and 8. It's very close to 8, but hasn't quite reached 8 yet. So it's 7 something. And the minute hand is on 11. And 11 times 5 is 55. So the time is 7.55. And what time does this clock show? Well, the hour hand is between 11 and 12, so it's 11 something. And the minute hand is on 9, and 9 times 5 is 45, so the time is 11.45, which we can also say is a quarter to 12.